So now we're ready to talk about the change of base. Um, and most people refer to this as the change of base formula, um, but I don't really want you to think of it as a formula or just something to memorize. Um, instead, I want you to, to be able to manipulate these logs in order to um, achieve whatever it is you're looking uh, to get out of the base. Um, so in this case, we have log base four of seven. Um, and an example of why we might need to do this from time to time is if we ever do want to punch these into calculators, uh, most of our calculators have a log base 10 button and a natural log button. Um, but if we want to, to manipulate the log base 4 into one of those, uh, we'll go ahead and we'll start by just setting it equal to y, uh, which is something we've done in the past. Um, and then I'll actually go ahead and rewrite it in its exponential form. Uh, so that's going to be 4 to the y equals 7. Now, this is an exponential equation where the bases can't be made the same, so we'll go ahead and we'll introduce the log uh, to both sides of this equation. Now, you can pick whatever log you want to. Again, in, in context of how we're discussing this, I'm going to use either a log base 10 or a natural log so that I, I can punch it into the calculator. Um, so I'll go ahead and I'll log LOG both sides. And this is the one-to-one -one property uh, for logarithms. Uh, we, we studied in the last section uh, how you can go from uh, one single log uh, equals one single log with the same base back into this. So we're essentially just working backwards. Um, but the reason why the logarithm is so nice in this case is because now the y can be brought down. So I'll have y log of 4 equals log of 7. And if my job to start was to figure out what y is, then I'll just go ahead and divide off the log 4. So come to find out, if we want to know what log base 4 of 7 is, uh, in base 10, uh, it's the log of 7 over the log of 4, whatever your calculator says that is. Um, I should also point out, though, that, that it was arbitrary that I chose the log base 10. Um, I could have certainly picked a natural log or a log base anything for that matter. So um, as you, you look at this and as you punch it into your calculator to get an answer, um, go ahead and take it a step further and, and actually confirm that when you take the natural log of 7 divided by the natural log of 4, uh, you're actually going to end up getting the same thing. 